We have some new sound from Senator Heidi Heitkamp on why she is now choosing to vote no on Kavanaugh. Let's listen. It's a lifetime appointment. This isn't a political decision. If this were a political decision for me, I certainly would be deciding this the other way. Um, but, uh, you know, there's an old saying, history will judge you, but most importantly, you'll judge yourself. And that's really what I'm saying. I can't get up in the morning and look at the life experience that I've had and say yes to Judge Kavanaugh. Gloria Borger, I want to get your reaction because we know the latest polling shows that this move may not be good for her politically. Right. You know, Heidi Heitkamp is behind, what, a dozen points in the polls. She's been uh, sinking during the, the whole nomination uh, process. And, uh, you know, red state, red state Democrats, this has really hurt them. And, and you were speaking earlier last hour about how this has motivated uh, the Republican base. And I think, that's, I think that's what you're seeing right now. And I think that's uh, why the president actually changed his tone on Dr. Ford uh, earlier this week when he started uh, uh, mocking her, if, if you will. I mean, look, this is, you know, this is political. The, the Democrats have to show that they have fought as hard as they could to please their base and also because they don't want them confirmed. Um, but we're heading into a midterm election here. And, and so this ain't beanball.